I spent the last two years making games in Unity. And let me tell you, it was really fun and sometimes really hard, but I learned a lot. And in this video, I will show you my whole game dev journey. My journey started in 2020. I learned basics of C Sharp in high school and I wanted to make something real with it. I searched on Google what is C Sharp used for and I came across Unity. So I decided to make my first game. After watching a few tutorials, I made some kind of gym simulator. Later. It was a mobile game where you tap on screen and your character gets jacked. After that, I tried making a Geometry Dash clone. Even though I made some progress and learned a lot, I wasn't satisfied. So I decided to make something a little more difficult. I decided to make my first platformer. I struggled a lot with this game and after some time I lost motivation and stopped making games completely. That all changed when I saw that Brackies is hosting a game jam. I decided to give it a another try. I teamed up with an artist named Miguel and we made this game in only 7 days. If you want to play it, it's completely free and the link is in the description. After that game, my confidence grew a lot and I decided to become a full-time game developer. I started working on my next game hoping that I can make a living with it. I worked really hard on it. I even got my brother to work together with me because I am not the best artist. But our dreams were shattered when we launched a Kickstarter campaign and realized that not everybody likes the game as much as we do. After that fail, I stopped game dev again. But one day, when I was looking back on all of it, I realized how much fun I had when I was making a game with my brother. So we decided to try again. Our next game is called Cody's Nightmare and it's a pixel art platformer game about a little boy named Cody who is trapped in his nightmare. If that sounds interesting to you, you can follow the progress of this game on this channel and on Twitter. You can also follow our Kickstarter page. All links are below, since it takes much more time to make these animations than to put them together with code, I had some extra time and made this YouTube channel. And since then, I made 4 more games. First, I made a game in 7 days where you collect Bitcoin and fight big NFT boss. After that, I tried to make my first 3D game. And in some later videos, I polished that game. Links to all those videos are below. Third game that I made on this channel was a little game for a game jam called GeoJam. And in my last video, I made a game about one of my favorite YouTubers, Danny. When I look back at my first game, I realize how much I actually learned, even though I have so much more to learn. If you enjoyed this video, please like, consider subscribing, and I think that you would really enjoy this video here.